All right, guys, we got hole seven. So you're going to need an Epoch 5 here because if you got an Epoch 4 or EM8 or 9, you're going to need to use a power four ball. So I'm going to make sure that my um, Epoch is in, ex uh, you know, pretty much exact uh, maximum distance. I'm going to go full right spin, so three right spin and a half a bar back spin. I'm using a Kingmaker here, so this is a glitch. I'm adjusting max plus 10. And we want the ball to be around the 335 mark, so our Grizzly is an exact mid. So it's not going to be in between mid and min or in between mid and max. It'll be exact mid distance. And if you want to maybe move it over um, a little bit more, um, so the ball kind of comes in a little bit more centered. I like where it comes here, um, so I'm going to leave it. Just uh, know if you hit great right, uh, you know, you're not going to be happy. All right, so here we're going to go three backspin, a half a bar right spin. We're going to have our blue ring just slightly over the rough line. Now, I second-guessed myself on this and moved the line at the last second, which I'm super pissed that I did that because I would have dropped it. So we're going to have our second bounce just above that uh, rough line, so on the fringe. Now, this is where it should have stayed. I should have kept it right here, all right? So what we're looking at here is we got our square, and then the line is just kind of coming in over that area, all right? And it's about an eighth into the square, okay? And then you can see our second bounce here is just in front of that rough line, okay? Because when the ball lands here, it's going to kick the ball to the left, all right? It's going to kick it way to the left. So if you are if you are centering the line directly through the pin it's going to kick it and the ball is going to definitely come out here somewhere all right so that's why i am offsetting it okay now this is where i move it at the last second all right and you can see that now i'm over all the i'm so okay let me explain this a little better here so you can see that there is the middle of these green squares. I'm on the opposite side now, okay? I would like you to put it in the middle if you could. All right, that's where I would like you to place it. Because on the inside where I have it there, I think if I had hit perfect, it would have come in on the left side. I like to show shots that are hitting dead center. That's when you know it's dialed. All right, so let's take a look at the shot. So this is when I second-guessed myself. So we are adjusting mid plus 10. Gonna wanna hit perfect here. And the ball is just gonna burn the right edge of the cup. So very important to have that line placed correctly because um, this will be a good um, shot to add to your card.